Fulton County Public Library, the Rochester branch, and the Fulton branch, and we're going to do Rumpled Turkey, a Thanksgiving twist on Rumpled Skilt Skin. Once upon a time, there was a lonely king who loved to eat, so he was looking for a wife. People all over the kingdom were trying to get him to marry their daughters. They were promising that their daughters could do almost anything. I'm very tired of all the nonsense. One man said his daughter could ride on unicorns. Now that's ridiculous. The one before that said his daughter could turn straw into gold. Outlandish. The king was getting to the point of screaming when there was a knock at the door. Oh no, another one. Enter. Your Majesty. What do you want? The miller handed the king a fine looking loaf of bread. My daughter baked it. Hmm, thank you. Why, it's delicious. Best I've ever tasted. Ooh, the mm. king gobbled mm. it up. Mm. He thought... I wish I had a wife who could bake like this. Thanksgiving was coming soon, so the king told the miller... What I wouldn't give for a home-cooked turkey dinner. Why, my daughter makes the best turkey dinner in this kingdom, or any kingdom. Hmm. The king thought... Here we go again. But then he remembered the bread. If your daughter can make a turkey dinner as well as she bakes bread, I'll gladly marry her. But the king warned the miller that if he was lying, he would be thrown into the dungeon. The dungeon? Well, you see, my daughter, she... Enough! Oh. Enough! Bring her tomorrow. The foolish miller was shaking as he left the palace. Oh, what have I done? When the miller got home, he told his daughter about the news. Daughter, wonderful news. Tomorrow you will meet the king. Oh, don't be silly, father. I don't want to meet the king. The miller burst into tears. Oh, but if you don't, the king will throw me in the dungeon. Oh, what kind of a cruel man would lock you in the dungeon for nothing? Well, it really wasn't nothing. It wasn't really something. It was really a little something of nothing. It was, Father, please. Tell me what you told him. So the miller explained how the king loved bread and wanted a turkey dinner. I told him that you could make the best in all the kingdoms, near and far. <laughs> I can't even cook. You do all the cooking. You should make the turkey dinner. Well, I don't think the king wants to marry me. Mary? <gasps> The king wants to marry me? I think he will, once he sees how beautiful you are and how well you sew and clean. The daughter started thinking mm. that maybe everything would be okay after all. Is the king handsome, father? Well, uh, he's a bit, never mind, I'll see tomorrow. So the daughter decided to visit the king the next day and she would explain to the king that there was a slight misunderstanding with her father. The king was happy to see her and welcomed her into the castle. Good day, my beautiful lady. Good day, your hands, hands, oh, good day, your majesty. The daughter was shocked at how unattractive the king looked. Thank you for the delicious bread you baked for me. The bread I baked for you? Yes, quite splendid it was. And your father told of your fantastic turkey dinner. Well, you see, that's not exactly so. Why, I can't even... Hush now, my pretty. The king didn't listen to the daughter. He knew that the famous chefs are always quite modest about their creations. So he told her to make another loaf of bread for him. 
while he took care of business. If she could make another delicious loaf by the time he returned, they would talk about marriage. If not, then he would throw her father into the dungeon for lying. Oh dear, I don't even want to marry him. And I don't want my father in the dungeon. Oh help, oh help, oh help! Suddenly, she heard a voice. Have no fear. Rumpled Turkey is here. Go, 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 go. What was that? Oh, uh, go, 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 go. No, nope, not this room. Sorry, lady. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, ouch. <sighs> Who are you? Go, 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 go. Didn't you hear me coming? Of course I heard you coming. Half the kingdom heard you coming. His landings, they need a little practice. Mm, yeah. Gobble, gobble, gobble anyway. Rumpel turkey to the rescue. Just your average, ordinary superhero of the poultry variety. Hmm. Gobble, gobble, now what's the trouble? Well, I'm supposed to bake a loaf of bread for the king and I'm hopeless at cooking. Oh, gobble, 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 gobble. Is that all? <laughs> Why, I can whip you up a loaf in no time. Oh, good. So Rumpel Turkey looked in the pantry for the ingredients. Ooh, oh, gobble, 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 now to the oven. Here we go. Gobble, 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 gobble. Ooh, that looks delicious. Oh, all in a superhero's day. Why, just, oh. Oh, are you all right? Oh, gobble, gobble, I keep tripping on my superhero cape. Oh, hmm. I can fix that. You can. Maybe. Here. Now, that's better. I don't think you'll have any more troubles with your cape. The king was home and coming down the hall. <gasps> you better go. Oh, I can't. I can't believe you fixed my cape. Nobody ever helps me. I help them. Leave now. Oh, yes, I will go, fair maiden. But first, pray, tell me your name. Go! Go! The daughter pushed Rumpel Turkey right into the king and knocked him oh. over. Turkey ran out of the castle before the king could see him. Oh, oh, what was that? Oh, just the breeze. I keep the windows open when I bake. Whew, it's hot in here. Well, let's taste that delicious bread of yours. Okay. Hmm. hmm. Even more delicious than the last loaf. It, it had a different texture, some special ingredients perhaps. The king saw it. It was a, what, what? What's this? A feather in the bread? Oh, yes, I do throw in a few feathers to make it fluffy. Like a pillow? Mm-hmm. Oh, I never would have thought of that. Come, <laughs> let's go for a walk. Okay. So the daughter and the king had a lovely walk in the courtyard. And when they returned, the king was feeling hungry again. Hmm, how about making us some delicious cookies to snack on? <gasps> no! I mean, wouldn't you rather wait a while? You know, I'm still really full from that bread, aren't you? Oh, I just can't get enough of your delicious baking. I want some chocolate chip cookies. So the king left and said he would be back in an hour or so. Here we go again. I can't bake cookies. Oh, help. Oh, help. Oh, help! Go, 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 go! Have no fear! Rumpel Turkey is here! Oh, ouch! You know, I was hoping you would come back, but I was hoping 
you would come back a little quieter. Oh, come on, come on, come on, can't do that, lady. A superhero always yells, <clears throat> Come on, come on, come on, rumble turkey to the rescue! Shh, the king thinks I'm up here alone. What's the trouble, fair maiden? Well, the king wants me to bake some chocolate chip cookies. And, well, I can't bake any better than the last time I met you. You know, I was kind of hoping that maybe... Oh. Gobble, 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 gobble. Uh -huh. gobble, 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 Yes, yes, you were hoping that I could whip you up some delicious cookies. Yes. It's easier than bread, my dear. Oh, good. So the rumpled turkey went into the pantry. Oh, boy. And, uh, and soon had cookies. Ta-da! <gasps> wow, they look terrific. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Try one. Okay. Mm mm mm. They are delicious. If only I could bake even half as good as you. Oh, go 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 go! If only I could sew half as good as you. <laughs> we make a good team, don't we? You are kind of cute. Oh, wait, you've got a button loose right here. I'll fix that. There. I can't believe it. I didn't even ask for help, and she fixed my cape. Now, my button. Rumpled Turkey was not used to anyone helping him. He always helped others. So he was very happy that the daughter had helped him, but now the king was coming back. Oh dear, you have to go now. I will go, gobble, 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 but first, fair maiden, your name. Go right now! The daughter pushed the turkey right into the king and knocked him over. Then he ran as fast as he could out of the castle before the king could see him. <laughs> oh, that's some strong breeze up here. Oh, yes. Well, um, it helps me bake better. Here, try one. Hmm, chocolate chip. Mm-hmm, chocolate chip thumbprint cookies, your majesty. Thumbprint cookies, you say? Mm hmm Hmm, looks more like a bird's footprint. <gasps> so that's how he flattened the cookies. What was that you said? Oh, nothing. Eat. Eat. Oh, these cookies are divine. Mm -hmm. Well, my pretty, tomorrow is Thanksgiving and you will need all your strength to cook me the best turkey dinner I've ever had. And after that, you shall become my wife. Come, I'll show you to your room. Okay. Come along. The next day, the daughter was back in the king's kitchen worrying about how to make a turkey dinner for the king. And I'm supposed to marry him. Ugh. Oh, help. Oh, help. Oh, help. Oh, whoa. Well, oh, gobble, 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 gobble. that uh, was a little better. Yeah, have no fear, Rumpled Turkey is here. Yeah, a little better. I've been practicing now. Oh, gobble, gobble, what's the trouble? Well, the king wants me to cook him a turkey dinner. Turkey dinner? Oh, 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 I'm sorry, oh, 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 oh. I forgot. I'm not cooking you a turkey. I forgot you're a turkey. Oh, gosh. Oh, 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 but what am I going to do? Oh, if I don't prepare oh. him the best turkey dinner he's ever had, my goose is cooked. Your goose is cooked. Oh, sorry. Listen. You just have to help me, please. Oh, gobble, gobble, gobble. I'm a superhero. Mm -hmm. Tell you what, I'll give you three chances to guess my name. And if you do, I'll help you with the dinner. Um, rumpled turkey? Drat! That one <laughs> never works on me. Well, I guess it's my goose who's cooked. Not so fast. I have an idea. Listen. Oh, gobble, 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 gobble. Just, that, yeah. that just might do it. Let's go. So the next day, which was Thanksgiving, the king ate the wonderful meal with the daughter the daughter had prepared for him. 
outstanding meal, my pretty. The sweet potatoes were scrumptious. Thank you. The cranberries were cooked oh, to perfection. Mm -hmm. The pumpkin pie was delectable. Yes, my favorite. And the turkey. Wait a minute. Where was the turkey? The turkey? Why, he was out here with me, Your Majesty. You see, my turkey dinner is very special in that it requires a turkey to help me cook it. And where is he now? He's doing the dishes. Oh, well, I never heard of that cooking secret before. Anyway, I've made up my mind. The king whispered in the daughter's ear and left the dining room. Oh. Ugh, I'm to be his queen tomorrow. Oh, help, oh, help, oh, help, help. Oh, gobble, gobble, what's wrong now? The meal is finished, the dishes are done, the... I have to marry the king. Marry the king? <gasps> tomorrow. Oh. Maybe you'll have to run away and become a superhero like me. Gobble, gobble, gobble. That's how I avoided marrying Clementine. Gobble, 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 gobble. Clementine? Who's Clementine? Oh, she was a chick I met in my younger days. Oh. Their parents had arranged the marriage. Clementine grew up kind of like the king. <laughs> and I ran away. That's how I became Rome Pool Turkey Superhero to all the daughter had a wonderful idea and whispered to turkey oh come on, come on come on yes come on we've got a lot of work to do okay the next day was the wedding day for the king and his queen as the bride came to meet the king with her heavy veiled face the king whispered oh that's quite the veil you have my pretty let me lead you so the preacher performed the wedding ceremony and ended by saying, I now pronounce you man and wife. You may kiss your bride. Uh, um, the end. Ah, I'm Goldie from the Fulton Fulton County Public Library in Rochester, and I have a special song for Thanksgiving. <laughs> Albuquerque is a turkey, and he's feathered, and he's flying, and he wobbles, and he gobbles, and he's absolutely mine. Bok, bok, he's the best cat that you can get, better than the dog or cat. He's my Albuquerque turkey, and I'm very proud of that. He once told me very frankly he preferred to be my pet, not the main course at my dinner, and I told him not to fret. Now my Albuquerque turkey is so happy in his bed. 